calling? Yeah, that's that loud shit. Yeah, I be loud on my latest trip. I be drunk in my latest <laughs> Tens, tens. Am I muted? Are we good? W mics. What's up, folks? Happy Thursday back on the surgical stream. How's everybody doing, chat? What up? What up? What up? We are almost to the end of the week. Uh, uh, chat, well, listen, man. I wish I was on night sweats last night instead of being at that fucking stars game. Fuck, man. You're done with two gagaroonies. <laughs> I was so, so happy. You have no fucking idea, bro. Uh, legacies from Mr. Scary Mask Guy. That guy is literally him. He's the reason Jordan has resurrected the goat whale. Uh, that was literally my favorite thing I've ever seen, bro. That's what I was I was forgetting why I even put Jordan in the goat whale. And then I was reminded exactly why he's in there. Because his piss nukes are, they're something else, bro. They just hit different. But now we're sweating Vladdy, bro, because this guy's kind of being a bozo lately. ESPN's got him projected a 116 hits, bro. That's bad. And Shohei went yard for old time's sakes. Um, and who else went yard? There was somebody else. Oh, Aaron Judge also finally fucking went yard. Uh, recap yesterday real fast, chat. Uh, pretty solid day for the Surgeons, 20 and 14 on the, on the prize picks. However, the book plays were a, a just absolutely horrific, 5 and 12. Jesus Christ, bro. Uh, we almost smacked a couple entries yesterday. Uh, the, the morning yap six man, McDavid, McBagel, one and a half points, bageled, bro. That was absolute rat shit. Uh, and then the community gobbler. Remember when I was crafting yesterday? We had four whales, and we couldn't find two others on the diamond to go with. Well, the two that on the the two that were on the diamond uh, were the ones that chalked it. Chernak hits free coin comes in again with a free square. That shit was green in the first period. Uh, Evander Kane hits that dude banged another dude in the glass right in front of us multiple times. Pause. Uh, LeBron's assist didn't end up cashing that demon. Sadly for. I forget that person's name that came on. Fuck. Uh, and Capella rebounds. That shit smacked in the first half. I think he had 13 in the first half. Uh, O'Neal Cruz, conversations need to be had about Waxahachie with him uh, over bases. That was moose shit. Dude had, I think I saw four, three pitch strikeouts. Or not four, but there was at least two. Uh, and Mookie actually didn't turn green for once this year. Shocker. Uh, but we were close. I made some coin with some two, two X's and shit. Uh, and that over in the stars game had me in quail shit. Uh, and McDavid bagels. I fucking bet Kells. I bet Kells. Um, and then the Pelicans ended up selling Ron's Bozo pack. No way. Uh, and the Cubs blowing the run line cost me some coin. That was rat shit. I don't know how they blew that. I was not expecting a full queue of surgeons to start us off. Uh, considering how moose shit today's slate is. Um, but I did put some coin aside to nuke some shit today. I've got one nuke already, a five-man. I'll spoon-feed it to you later if you didn't watch the morning yap already. Uh, but I will spoon-feed that. But let's nuke some shit today, bro. I need some whales, please. We have a, a rat shit MLB slate, but we do have like five NBAs and uh like seven or eight nhls so let's fucking go that, that'll do that we'll have to make that work all right so let's get surgical we got goats and q if you have to leave early let me know and again shout out that mass man dude that shit was insane uh with Jordan yesterday let's go with uh if you have to leave early let me know i'm just gonna go down lists uh and get rid of some of the guys in their cars that probably have to dip and let's go with b camp b camp we got the nit championship tonight do you have a play in this game you know i do Trey. Got a couple plays. Do. uh first of all all-time fumble with the six man last night you had herner in there dude i fucking had now. herner in there bro and then the weather the geologist scared me off it bro god damn it Trent. <laughs> all right indiana state seton hall it's gonna be a great game 
Uh, I was going to try and go, but just can't make it happen. So uh, prop today in this game, we're taking Julian Larry over four and a half assist. Uh, this guy's a baller, man. He has full minutes all the time, so we don't got to worry about that. Um, and he averages over this assist number quite uh, frequently. 4.8 uh, assists per game on average. Uh, he's three he, over this line in three of his last five, seven of his last 10, 11 of his last 15, hitting at a 68% clip. So I like this. Uh, Seton Hall is number 270th ranked in assists given up to their opponent, allowing over 14 per game. Uh, Indiana State is number nine in uh, assists per game, so with over 17 a game. So great, uh, great matchup recipe here for Larry to get six or seven assists for us. So. Larry over four and a half assists on prize picks for B camp in the NIT championship. He's on Indiana State. And we need five assists. That's the one. Let's, Let's have a go. Day go Sycamores. Yes, sir. B Camp, appreciate you as always, brother. Good luck. GG's, BC's. Let's keep it rolling. Keep tempo crispy. Let's go with Chops out, Bamuel. What's up, Chops? Didn't get to pitch my play yesterday. I was going to give you Yankees money line, uh, but had no service like all day. Did hit an eight-legger last night. It's all that, bro. That was fucking so. That, that's a Bamuel vintage Red Rock lay if I've ever seen one. One of my homies said all the favorites were winning in the NHL, and they did. So they, I was like, that's a banger. So, bro, no way. Uh, no one. Today, I'm giving you Pirates money line. I think they beat the Nationals. Um, give me Martin Perez on the mound. Just better team. Better team. Better teams, better players. Let's yes, go. Sir. Pirates ML. We'll be seeing. Be seeing chopped out Bamuel. That's a guy that just makes gambling look so easy, bro. Just like pick more, pick less. It's that easy. That's literally Bamuel. All right. I'm going easy Jari outside and it's your boy DG. Jari, what up? Mitch Keller needs smelling salts or some Zins or something before the game. <laughs> he starts so slow. It's literally the most annoying shit as a Pirates fan. Yeah, he needs a prize pick hat. Anyways, I'm going with Russell Westbrook, PRA over 19 and a half today. No Kawhi. Jokic might not be playing. It doesn't really matter. But I think Russ versus the Nuggets bench, he's just he's a sixth man of the year, in my opinion. I don't care what no one says. And he's hit this three of his last four on the Clippers. So, okay. All right. Uh, Westbrook. Actually, I'm, I'm going to go with fantasy score. Fantasy, fantasy score. score. Yeah. A last second pivot for Jari. He gets a lot of rebounds and assists. And he might not get a lot of points. So. Okay. Yeah. And and steals as well. You got that in, in play. All right, Jari. Westbrook. Westbrook fantasies. Let's get it, bro. Appreciate you. Yup, yup. Be seeing. I forgot to go uh, check out. Wow. There's only one undefeated, sir. Uh, not not one undefeated, but Free Coin's the only gentleman who's three and zero. Let's go, Free Coin. Uh, let's keep it rolling. It's your boy DG. What's up, dude? What's good, bro? We're gonna go with the uh Golden State Warriors minus four today, bro. Let's fucking I, go. I feel like uh, you know, Tari Eason, I feel like he rubbed a lot of the uh, a lot of them guys the wrong way. I feel like they come out tonight and they show them why they were back to back with repeated champions. Uh yeah, I just think they handled them tonight, bro. Golden State Warriors minus four. Okay. Golden State Warriors minus four. I'm on that. I'm tailing. Let's go, DG. Yes, sir. We'll be seeing, brother. Dude's always swimming underwater. Uh, w tempo and pace and solid plays so far. I'm going Vito, Yeti, and, and Brock D. Uh, if you have to leave early, oh, I got I got two corp coach real quick. Nappy and Lenbong. Nappy, what's good, my goat? Trent, what's going on? How what's up, doing? Bro? Uh, not much the nerfy cash yesterday, so trying to keep yeah. the streak going. Yes. Yeah. So today, um, I got a three unit play in MLB today. Um, oh, gross slate. I know no one likes it. Um, it's <laughs> kind of nice because you get some push potential with this one, but I don't think we're going to need it. It's the over eight in the uh Marlins uh Cardinals game. Ooh. Um, you got two, in my opinion, turkey tossers. <laughs> Obviously, Lance Lynn is making his home debut. Um, as a Cardinal this season, he's making his second tenure with that team. Um, the Marlins have to get something going. Everybody knows that. They've been dog shit to start the season, don't have a win yet. 
Um, and I only way I see them winning this game, and I do think they're going to find a way to win, but um, the game's going over. I mean, eight's too low of a line with, with two guys who throw a lot of fastballs. The guy who's going for, um, for Miami, whether he's not good, um, he's also a lefty, which um, the heart of that Cardinals lineup mashes lefties for the most part. Um, and the Cardinals are coming home after looking pretty good out in San Diego. Uh, I think the juices will be flowing in the ballpark tonight. And I think eight runs is not asking too much, especially with some push potential. So, Okay. All right. We're getting bangs and Marnels. Marnels. Marlins Cardinals over eight. Yep. Yep. I like this one a lot. And we're just going to keep staying hot on the, on the diamond. So. Okay. Let's go, Nap. Yep. We'll be seeing. All right. Have a great day, homie. We'll be seeing. Uh, that just reminded me, chat. Mardinals Nerfies. I know we just pitched the over, but Mardinals Nerfy. Dude, I, I'm an idiot. I totally missed the Nerfy. All right, Vito, Yeti. Uh, before I before that, though, Lembong said he had to go court. Lembong, dude, what's up? What up? Back for my uh, bi-monthly appearance on stream. <laughs> um, got uh, one play. I'll keep a tempo and pace. Uh, going with the under 228 in the Warriors Rockets. Mm. Um, these two teams have played twice this year, going under the first time and then soaring over the most recent time. Houston is under 110 in four of their last five. Golden State's under 115 in nine of their last 12 um, with a number four and number seven defensive rating home or away. Um, so rocking with the under 228, two units. I think it's uh should hopefully be pretty easy. Okay, let's Famous go. Last last ball. Good to see you, bro. It's been a minute going. Yeah, man. Warriors uh, Rockets under. Yes, sir. Heard you on BTL, bro. You can't cancel me. I'll be back in a couple months. <laughs> <laughs> let's go, Lembong. W's, bro. All right. Have a good one, bro. All right, be seeing, be seeing. Yeah, I thought oh, I thought he was canceled. Sorry, Yeti. Sorry, Yeti. Vito Yeti Brock D. Uh Vito. Dial in, bro. What's up? Yes, sir. Um, today, do you want the MLB or NBA? Let's go NBA. I need. I'm counting on you for NBA. James Harden more than 16 points. Oh my God, Vito! First leg of our entry is Harden. All right, that's the first leg. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Have a great rest of your day, Vito. You too. We'll be seeing. Be seeing. Let's fucking go. Guy gets it. Yeti. Needs you dialed in for the NBA too, bro. I do have an NBA play today. Uh, it's it's good to get back into the NBA on a on a moose shit uh, MLB slate today. Timberwolves are back in first place. That's right where they belong. I uh, got that one seed back. Uh, whole game ahead of your Oklahoma City Thunder, I bet. Easy. Uh, <laughs> uh, shout out to the community yesterday going four for four on our uh, our our prize pick slip, and then we get the. Uh, the prize picks employees to come by. Trent hits the most popular tab, goes over the popular tab, hits Mookie Betts, and then, but, 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 it's a snow game. We heard eight pitches for Nico Horner yesterday. Eight pitches. Eight of them. And fucking O'Neill Cruz, man. It's on baseball better, but baseball bet better than that, dude. That was bad. I'll actually, I'll give Yeti flowers for this chirp. It's definitely earned. <laughs> um, Today, I have uh, I have uh, Bogdan Bogdanovich over 24.5 PRA. Um, in the only meeting that they played against Dallas, he hit this back when Trey Young was playing. You know, a lot really doesn't change with Bogdanovich, which I was kind of surprised to see um, with Young off the floor. His usage rate actually takes a slight tick down. But um, if you paid attention recently this week, he was yapping at the coach. And uh, I really like the narrative of him just wanting to go out and say, fuck you, coach, and light it up. I, dude, he was getting in his coach's grill. That's because he was cooking and he put him on the bench. Yeah. He, this dude can play. So um, 24 and a half. I, I know his points is on the popular tab, but I just prefer the PRA. Okay. All right. PRA is a solid look. Bogdan Bogdanovich, PRA for Yeti. Let's go, brother. Yeah, the game's got like a 227 and a half total, too. So. Okay. All, All signs right. point to yes. All right. Yeah, he appreciates you, bro. That's how you lab. Later, brother. Be seeing, be seeing. Chat, would you shut up, bro? Brock D, Turner Mac, Book of Chew, uh, and Ron Mox. I'm so sorry that I took forever to get to you. What's up, Brock D? What's up, Trent? Um, please going? tell me you, you didn't take Seabold last night, did you? I fucking did, bro. 
Dude, I woke up in fucking urine once again. Urine. urine. It's fucking. okay. I, I faded. I faded fucking Kim Jong whatever, and and I'm sorry. That was bad. I faded That's somebody, crazy. and he scored under hit run RBI. Dude, I, I mean, I'm just in rat urine. I mean, I take Merrill Kelly K's yesterday, has four through three innings, finishes with four, pitches seven innings. I fucking bet, bro. All right. All right. <laughs> we're we're, we're getting it back today. Bags, bro. Uh, I'm taking Josiah Gray over 15 and a half pitches thrown in the first inning. I'm going to channel my inner LC and hopefully wow. uh, get some uh, MLB live. Uh, hopefully we're not donating today. What was the play one more time? Uh, Josiah Gray over 15 and a half pitches thrown in the first inning. Oh, okay. Okay. That can be cheeky getting surgical with the LC first inning pitch johns. Yeah. I'm pairing it with Lance Lynn because he fucking blows as well. So, <laughs> all right, Brock D, let's go, dude. Yeah. Have a good day, everybody. Hey, you too. We'll be seeing. We'll be seeing. Um, yeah. I woke up and I tried throwing another like miracle slip. Did not go, did not go to plan. Uh, Turner Mac, Book of Cheward. What's up, Turner Mac? What's good, Trent? How we doing? The, the Jordan fantasy yesterday was air. I mean, that that's the wager of the year so far. So far, indeed, wager of the year. It made me so fucking happy. Yeah, dude, I was stoked when he hit the first one because it cashed, and then I saw the second one. And I'm like, oh my god, fucking yeah. probably splooshing right now. You should have had four. Honestly. I know. I, I saw a stat that he hit five balls over like a hundred mile yeah. per hour exit velo. Crazy. First but, player ever to do that, by the way. Yeah, that was, that was nuts. So I'm, no. I'm glad we got our lick back with him. But yeah. we're on to a new play. Um, going Pablo Lopez uh, under strikeouts today, actually. Oh, yeah, no, I I know. Let me let me sell you on it real quick. Because I, I'm typically on his over. We all know he has strikeout stuff. He averaged uh, 7.3 strikeouts per game last year. But he's going up against the Guardians. And the Guardians don't really strike out. They strike out uh, 6.71 times per game. Um, and last year they struck out seven times per game. So they, I mean, they're bottom three in strikeout rate. He pitched against them three times last year. Um, and he had five strikeouts, five strikeouts and three strikeouts. He went six innings each game. So it's a pretty tough matchup for him. And the line was at six this morning and it already moved down to five and a half. So I kind of oh. like the line movement. Um, and I, I think it hit today. Okay. Yeah, you've been surgical with the unders, and we're going with under Pablo Lopez at five and a half Ks. Yes, sir. Okay. Let's go, Turner Mac. All right. We'll be seeing. Be seeing. Peace, doggy. Appreciate you. Yo, Ahan, I can't believe you literally said in chat, please take the Pablo Lopez demon square, trying to get me to fade the play that you're on, bro. I almost actually locked that shit in. Bozo. Uh, Book of Chew, what's up, dude? Surely Mookie, the hottest hitter in baseball, can give you two bases, right? Right, I bet, bro. Yeah, I bet. Uh, so, do you want to over under in the NBA, or do you want a plus money NBA prop? I'll let you pick. Uh, let's go with an NBA prop, Chew. All right. Well, three words: Joker triple double, no yeah. sell job. The dude's just an outright dog. He'll get a triple double probably in the third quarter. Yes, I fucking love it. I'm praying he plays. No fluke shit. Let's just get Jokic in the game, and we're good. He's probable. Uh, Jamal Murray's questionable. Okay. All right. Sheward, uh, Jokic tripped up loading. Yes, sir, baby. Be seeing. Hey, hey, sorry about the about, about Chelly's play last night. I know he's on Euler, but the stars, man, I just kind of – Yeah. Kinda, I mean – The over just never came home, man. It's all right. Yeah, yeah it's all good, man. We get it back. We get Much it love, back. Trent. Be seeing. Much love. Stay goaded, Chew. Be, be seeing. We'll be fucking – um, all right. Anyone have to go? Oh, Ron Mox, dude. Get in here. Ron Mox, bro. What up? Chad, what's going on, man? How are you doing today? Great. How are you? I'm all right. Uh, we lost another one from the Pelicans yesterday, unfortunately. So looking for a bounce back today. Going to stick to the ice. Going to give you the Jets money line and the Kings money line. Uh, so the, the Kings are playing the Sharks today. Kings, a better team on the road. Uh, this is the fourth time these teams played this year. The Sharks actually beat them the last time in a shootout. Uh, so I like the Kings to win this game. They're uh, fighting for standings today, second in the wild card right now. And we got the Jets today. They played the, the Flames twice this year, both in Calgary. They lost both of those games. Uh, we got the Jets 24-11-3 at home. They just got a win in their last game after losing six straight. So I like them to get right again tonight, uh, win at home. So one unit on the Bozo Pack. The chain we need, uh, the chain is what we needed today, bro. I love it, Ron. 
Bozo Pack, Jets, and Kings, both money line for Ron Mox in a bounce back spot. Yes, sir. Let's see one go through the hoop this week. Chain gang, stand up. Let's mock. Let's fucking go, Ron. Appreciate you, Goat. All right, man. All the best. Good seeing you. We'll be seeing. We'll be seeing. No way Riley Green just went yard in my rookie auto. Fucking uh, Ruby Red Prism just skyrocketed in value. <laughs> SBR. Uh, all right. Let me check private chat. Corp in 10 minutes from Herd of Goats. And then I'm going to go Achilles and Bobby Nugs. Uh, Herd of Goats. What up, dude? How's it going, Trent? Good. Good. How are you? Pretty good. Uh, got a win with my last play. I think I came in on Tuesday last time, pitched a strikeouts legacy game for Bieber. He got nine, I think it was. Yes, indeed. Cleared it in like one inning. He was at four, and then I watched all three guys just get K'd back to back. Felt so good. Yeah. Um, today we're going Alex Kirilov over one and a half total bases. It's plus one fifteen on DK home opener for the Twins. I think the ball is going to be moving, but it's not going to be leaving the park too much. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. Kirilov's been hot, so two bases. I like that he has been hot, and you know that Twins stadium is going to be buzzing. Yes, sir. And the wind blowing the field, which is the shorter one and better for Kirilov. So if he gets it, he might go yard. Who knows? Okay. Let's go, Herd of Goats. W play Kirilov over total bases. Yes, sir. Let's go. Appreciate you, Herd of Goats. Good luck. Be seeing you too. You too. W tempo and pace and W vibes. What is the score of that twin of that Tigers game right now? Are Tigers betters in pit or uh sorry, who are they fucking playing again? Oh, the Mets. Tie game. I just saw the Mets were minus 1,700 at, like five minutes ago. All right, Achilles, Bobby Nugs, Bear Bats, Snacks. What's up, Achilles? We're muted. We're muted. Every day. There we go. Uh, uh, I'm going to take the Jets tonight against Calgary, but I'm not taking the money line. I'm taking them in reg and mm -hmm. at minus one and a half. Um, I'll probably do two on two units on each one, so probably four units total. Calgary's beat them at uh, five to three and six to three. So give me the Jets and Reg for minus one thirty-five. Love that. That could be a good lay piece. The Jets. Yep. Are you red hot, Achilles? That's what rumors uh, are saying. Yeah, I'm two and two and one. It should be three and one, three and zero. Oh, I just took Iowa instead of the Mets, but okay. Two, two right. five unit maxes on back to back days, so I'll take it. Let's go, Achilles. Jets right, and Reg and buy two. That's right. Let's go, brother. All right, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. We'll be seeing uh, Bobby Nuggets. What's up, Bobby Nuggets? Bear bets and snacks. What's up, Bobby? Bro, it was never Tatum. It was never uh, Tatum. It was always Porzingis. It was always Celtics by 30. Yeah, it sure was. It so we <laughs> missed Tatum down to 500 now, so we're going to fade ourselves today. Luca uh, under 33 and a half. Wow. I hate it. I hate it as much as you do. So listen, Ratchet Hawks allowed Malachi Flynn to drop a 50 bomb. Which Everyone's is going to be looking at Luca. That's incredible. W fake entry on the Twitter today, too. Um, <laughs> Luca, 73 last time that he played the Hawks. So everyone's going to be looking at Malachi Flynn's 50, Luca's 73, and think, oh, yeah, fucking over. Malachi. Not counting that 73 point game for Luca. Luca averages 23, 8, and 8 against the Hawks in his career. And everyone always looks at this game with, with the uh, Trey Young Luca trade and yep. expects fireworks. Fuck it. I'm fading myself. Under 33 wow. and a half. Blowout potential. He might not even play the fourth quarter. <laughs> wowie, wowie, wowie. Bobby fucking Nuggets. All right. Tens, tens, GGs, BCs. We will be seeing Bobby Nuggets. We'll see. Good luck. Good luck, bro. Luca yeah. Unders is always a bold call. Malachi fucking Flynn. <laughs> uh, it's Malachi, right? Or am I tripping? It, it's got it. Is it Malachi or am I? Um, maybe I'm wrong. It's Malachi W. All right. Bear bets, snacks. Bear bets. What's up, bro? Malachi, I bet. Uh, <laughs> yesterday I had um, Keller over strikeouts. That didn't go well. Today, quick, easy. Jokic over 13 boards. He had 15 and 16 in his. Uh, two games against the Clippers this season. The game that he didn't play, DeAndre Jordan had 13. 
I think we get this easily. Yes, sir. Bear bets for those who tune into the morning yap. That's one of my two wow. NBA prize pick squares. So that I don't know what that I'm means. Riding with you. Let's go. All, All right. right let's have a day. Yes, sir. We'll be seeing. If you tuned into the morning yappage, you got it before the bumpage. <laughs> Sorry, no need to celebrate that. And it big is the All right, Snacks, what up? Yo, Trent, you can go to P1 Bets first. He said he's corp as fuck. <laughs> P1 Bets. Hey, hey, maybe you stream, bro. And P1, I'm, I'm actually corp as fuck. Uh, it's just the Nuggets minus four. Uh, the Clippers are without Kawhi, so... I just don't trust them, and the Nuggets want that number one seed, so that's it. Yeah, back to work. Okay. Let's go back to work, P one. Get back to work because that's a losing wager, and you're gonna need the coin. <laughs> Snacks, what up, brother? I love that you cooked this play too. Um, <laughs> we're gonna give you a snack pack today. Snack packs. It's been a while. It's been uh, a minute. Uh, I'm gonna give you Brian Reynolds. And Josh Naylor each to get a hit. Oh, uh, it's okay. minus 102 on Fandle. Uh, Reynolds is four for eight with two extra base hits off of Josiah Gray. And he was 0 for four yesterday. And Josh Naylor is two for three against Lopez. And he's often 0 for three yesterday. Has a hit in all the games prior as well, just like Reynolds. So, okay. I haven't done the snack pack in a while. I haven't been on in a while. I'm in super court, but figured I'd come on today and hopefully give you guys a winner. Okay, let's go. Snacks, little Reynolds Naylor uh, snack pack for the kids. Yes, sir. Later, brother. Let's go. Appreciate you, homie. We get a snack pack today. Chat, Jokic is off of DraftKings. Somebody go tell me what the reason is for that. Uh, that could be bad. Let's go to uh, Adam's Got Wales. Putts winning with Welly. Adam's got whalers. What's going on, brother? How we doing, dude? Good, good. Rui came through, so we found we saw one go through the hoop. Nice. Um, <laughs> it's funny. I was, you know, I'm, I'll probably just stick with it. I have two first half plays, and I made a slip with them. So, um, Luca's one of them. I'm taking over his PRA first half. I, I, I'm. It'd be batshit crazy to think the guy's got balls, man. Taking under 33. Um, it's just the one guy I don't try to get cute with. Like Luca yeah. is just. He's just too much usage and too much everything for you to try it. But I get it. I respect it. And I do think that there's a possibility of a blowout. I actually think this might stay closer than people think. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and take over. Uh, I got him at 20 and a half. I don't know if he's still there, but over PRA first half for Luca. Um, okay. It's pretty simple and easy. And then I'll just tell you my other one so people can take it if they want. Miles McBride has been an absolute first half wagon. So I'm taking his over uh, eight and a half points. That's just like a bonus piece. Um, but I made a two man out of that. Luca can be my official play. Um, I'm not going to sell too much on it, man. I just love Luca and I love the spot. He's he's going to soar over this first half. Um, but I respect the guy taking his under points and good luck. Okay. W Adams got Wales. Luca first half PRA for the PRD. Let's go. Cheers. Be seeing. Be seeing. Are you buying into the Adams Got Wales hype chat with Luca for his halfers? All right, let's go to Putts. Putts, I need you dialed, my guys. Ottinger was dialed last night. Oh, my that? God, dude. That was the freest shit ever, bro. Ever. But the problem is, is Chelly comes in at the end of stream every day, and he gets in your head. Hey, At I will like say, I will eight. say, you helped me make you helped me make it uh, a rack because I threw an SGP, um, and the only thing that didn't hit for a fifty xer was fucking Hyman. But I had your goalie in there. Oh, I had geez. both goalies, but you That's did right. help me win some coins. So let's go. Hey, you doubled up, doubled up. Yeah. Um, so actually, I agree with um, Wales today because um, I'm going to Dejounte Murray points and assists thirty two and a half. So I do think this game is going to stay closer. Um, in order for me to say that I think that Atlanta is going to perform very well today, that means that um, the other side is going to perform as well. So um, DeJounte, last time they played, I think was in January. Trey was back when they were playing. He was playing back when they played him last. But um, DeJounte still had 22 points in that game. I think it was like 140-something to 140-something when they played. So I'm expecting high scoring, going back and forth here. But um, 
I think DeJounte gets it done with his points and assists tonight. Okay, DeJounte. I tailed you once with DeJounte before, and it was free. Yep. We're going back to him tonight. I mean, someone's got to fucking score, bro. I think I think the whole team's going to be scoring, so that's why I'm taking <clears throat> with the assist on top of the, that point. So. Okay. All right. I love the play. Let's go. Appreciate right. your thoughts. Later. You see him. Uh, Jokic is back on DraftKings, boys. We're good. We're good. Uh, all right. I said winning with Welly. What's up, Welly? How's it going, Trent? It's been a while. Good. How are you? Good. It's been a while. Um, so today I just got uh, the Sacramento Kings on the money line uh, versus the Knicks. The Knicks are a beat-up team today. They got no Julius Randle, um, possibly no Josh Hart, and no OG. Um, they've been on a streak, the Kings themselves. They just whooped up on the Clippers. I mean, Clippers don't have Kawhi, I get it, but um, I think it's a pretty solid lock here. So. Okay. I, I do as well. I think the Kings win games. They they probably shouldn't, and they're a dog in this spot. That's a good play. Uh, right. Kings money line, Welly. Let's go, dude. Appreciate you, man. Have a good rest of your day. Be seeing, be seeing you too. GG's. Uh, all right, we're moving and grooving today, dude. We're moving and grooving. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Z Gordo and Rito and Cool Thugger, and I see Guru Griff dialed zone. Dog has V with a return play. Um, all right, Z Gordo and that W ceiling of his. What's up, dude? What's up, man? How we doing? Good, good. What do you got today? Well, March was kind of shitty, huh? That fucking blew. I, that was probably one of my I worst up, months of all time. Oh, man, I ended up pretty far down on that leaderboard. So now that we're just on baseball, we're going to hope that that doesn't happen again. Yeah. Um, but I don't think chat's going to love this one, but I don't really give a shit. I think Guardians plus 130 today on the road against Minnesota, against Pablo Lopez. Um, I know it's a Twins home opener, but – both teams are facing a right-handed pitcher, and so far this season, Minnesota, uh, Cleveland's just been way better against right-handed pitching. They're slugging 417 against righties so far. Minnesota's only slugging 283. Um, also, Cleveland has a pretty decent history against Pablo Lopez. They're slugging 516, and a lot of those big left-handed batters are going to be in the lineup today against them. Uh, also, I know Tanner Beebe's pitching, and he was rat shit against the Oakland Athletics. I'm not saying that's a good sign. But he had never faced those guys before, and I really think that comes into play in baseball. He's faced some of these guys before, and they're only slugging 258 against them. So I think the familiarity will help a little bit. Also, the wind's blowing left to right, but it's going towards right field at this stadium when the game starts. And with seven lefties in the lineup for Cleveland, I know Minnesota also has six, but I just like the batters and I like the bats better in the guards lineup today, and and the matchup plays out for them too. Okay, the Gabba guards who have been pretty hot, uh, plus Chicky on the road in Minnesota for my guy Z Gordo. Let's go, brother. Yes, sir. Let's get some coin. W cell job. We'll be C's. We'll be C's. Peace. Peace. W's. That ceiling tells stories. Rito, get in the fucking queue, or you're in the queue. What's up, Rito? What's up, Trent? How are you? Good. Tough L on the Red Sox yesterday. What the hell, bro? 1-0? What the fuck is that, man? No, man. Devers is grounding into fucking ground balls every day, I bet. Yeah, at least Jaron Duran was free, so. Yeah, Ws. All right. Well, I got Vladimir Tarasenko, two and a half SOGs, Damon. Whoa. No Carter Verhage. He's moved up to line one, PP1, and it's his old team, the Sens. And the Sens give up the most shots to left wing among the positions that they guard. So that's free as fuck. That's the first leg of our demon slip we're making. Let's do it, bro. Tarasenko at two and a half SOGs. Yep. All right. Let's go, Rito. All right. I'm dialed, buddy. Let's Stay do locked. it. BCs, bro. BCs. Ws. Uh, don't be a, don't be scared of the of the SOG demons chat. I learned yesterday that they are definitely hittable. Let's get Welts's card out of the way. Welts, you always do that. I need Wait to know. So and somebody, and somebody give out my square, man. I'm sorry, I bro. Posted, I posted that about three four this morning. That all three, all four of his squares gonna be green by the night over with. All right. Well, what's the second leg of my my demon entry? I'm putting you in there. 
That was my square, but I like them for a goal as well. Wow. That, that's I'm, the square I was giving you. That's fucked up. Half. But it's all good. I, you know, I already got something else I can uh, revert to. Give me, um, what's his name? Hold on right quick. I ain't expect nobody else to be on that. But yeah, that, that was, I was going to get a whole sale job and all that shit since you like sales Fuck, jobs. dude. But yeah, we on the same thing. So yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. One, one, six, nine. Let me see what else I got. You want me to pull uh, you back up? Let me pull you back up. Go ahead. Go. W's, thank God. Uh, all right, Cool Thugger in Los Santos. Yo. What up? What's up, bro? Hey, first quarter play last night was sweat free. I believe I took the Suns. Yeah, I took the Suns. Yeah. But today, today I'm going to take Dallas, minus three and a half. Right back where I like to take these spats. The Hawks on the second leg of a back to back playing their fifth game in seven days. Um, Atlanta had to fly to Dallas, whether today or last night. Tyler Liz expected. Um, and a side note, um, Atlanta, they've just been like overachieve, overachieving the last month. They won six out of the last seven, had a couple big comeback wins. I believe it all ends tonight. I, I actually believe Dallas is going to cover the negative, I mean, the minus 12 as well. Okay. But I'm taking the first quarter spread. Minus three and a half with guys like Kyrie and Luca who like to start every game hot. I'm gonna take okay. the, uh, the minus three and a half. I like this. I think they cover the twelve also. First quarter minus yeah. three and a half for Cool Thugger. Yeah. Atlanta legacy run is over, man. <laughs> I like them though. I like them though, but it's over. Let's go, it's brother. Over. Appreciate you, right, my guys. See, see you next time. Yes, sir. Stay locked. Stay locked. All right, let's keep it moving. Let's keep it grooving. Well to spawned away so i'm just gonna go to guru griff and dialed zone let me check private chat corp can you bring me on next parker's piss yeah i will what's up what's up Trent? w yordan yesterday bro yeah i told bases that was fucking free a donk yep today i got lance lynn under pitcher fantasy score under 30 and a half so as we know lance lynn is absolute fucking moose in his career against the Marlins, he's played 10 games, and he's been under this in seven games, um, four out of the last five. The last game he played, it was just horrible. He allowed he allowed eight earned runs, only went four innings, had a one strikeout. That would be like a negative nine fantasy score. That was late last season, so most of the same players are on this Marlins team. They know what to expect from him, and they got to get him one eventually. So I think this is a really good spot against one of the worst pitchers in the league, and, yeah, I think he goes way under his number. Okay, let's go, Parker's picks. Under fantasy for Lance Lynn. Yep. All right, bro. Appreciate you. Also, I love that uh, not official play, but I love that under or the over in the White Sox game tonight. So you yes. Yeah. Let's Soroka's, go. Soroka's moves. He might give up eight himself. So need that. And I'm on that. Um, yeah. All right, dude. Appreciate you. Let's go. Yeah. Thanks. See it. Be seeing. Be seeing. All right. Back to Welta and then Guru Griff and Dialed Zone Packs picks. If you've been incubating, apologies. What up, Welta? All right, bro. The play was, um, damn. You just made me miss it again. No, dude. Hold <laughs> on, oh, man. I'm coming back to you. Uh, Guru Griff. Man, Welta's never ready for. I know, bro. God damn it. God damn it, Welta. But shout out the, uh, the women truck driver who gave that play right there. Shout out her. She was a W for oh. yesterday. We're rolling with the Bozo Pack today. We have the Avalanche over one and a half goals, and then we have the Royals over the White Sox money line. You pair those two together. It's like minus 125. That's how I got it. That's the Bozo Pack. Don't know what the fuck's going on in Kansas City with that vote or shit. I, I'm just a firm believer is if you're a billionaire, pay for your own fucking stadium. But I'm going with the Royals and then the Avalanche over one and a half goals. Bozo Pack. Okay, W Bozo Pack for Guru Griff. All right, bro. Good luck, man. GGs. You have a good one. GGs. GGs. All right. Oh, um, Welta. All right, bro. Can you hear me? Yes. All right. I gave you two plays yesterday, so I supposed to be three and oh. I'm going to give you two plays today that's going to be green, and they yeah. name it for sure. Um, Zaka, for an assist, and yeah. William Eklund for a point. Zach Zaka assists and Eklund to get a point. Damn right. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite? Uh, my favorite is going to be Zaka. Zaka? All right. That's Zaka the second leg. That's the second leg. That's right. All right. Let's go. Well, to stay locked. Always. Be seeing. Be seeing. 
We're moving and grooving, moving and grooving. All right, Elliot, I see you up there. I just realized you were there. I'm going to go dialed zone and then Elliot, then dog V and parks picks, packs picks. Sorry, dialed zone. What's up, bro? What up, Trent? How we doing? Good. I got to make my debut today for April, four and one last month. Um, so I'm going to take you to the Minnesota Twins, Cleveland Guardians game. Cleveland's been hot. Um, their bats have been hot, but it's all at the top of the order. So I'm taking Ramon Laureano under half a total base. Ooh. It's on prize picks. It's also minus 130 on the books. He's won uh, for six lifetime against Lopez. So I like this read. Okay, let's go, dog. Dialed zone, uh, Laureano under half a base. Yep. All right, that could be surge, dude. I like that one. Yeah, me too. All right. All right. Be seeing. Be seeing. Appreciate you. Let's go. Elliot, what's good, dog? What's good? What's good? Uh, people forget Altuve also went yard yesterday. People forget about Altuve going yard. Yep, yep. Uh, Astros got the trash cans back. Uh, yep. It'll be scary, scary hours coming. So yeah. Um, today, headed to the ice, I got Braden Point over two and a half SOGs. Ooh. Playing the Moose shit Canadians on the road. Uh, last four games against the Canadians, he has five, three, three, and four. Um, we know the Canadians, you know, they give up a lot of shots, give up goals. I do think the game is close. Um, Lightning just played yesterday. Tough game against Toronto. They won, but physical taxing. Um, so I like the Braden Point today. Two and a half SOGs. Okay. Point SOGs from Elliot. That could be a good one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We'll be. We'll be seeing. You know we will. You know we will. Kells, I see you yapping in chat. Just know that I faded the fuck out of the Sharks plus one and a half. Sorry. Uh, Dog as V making a return. What's good? Oh, we're driving. I'll bring you back. Uh, Pax Picks, what's up? What's up? Uh, not going to lie, Pax Picks off a of pouch might just be dialed. Dialed, that's bullshit. what we need. 2-0, and oh, same type of bets going first fives for MLB. Yesterday was the Red Sox. The second one in a row that hit with a one to nothing, which yep. is kind of, kind of freaky. Yeah. So that being said, I'm going back to another one today. Uh, give me the guards plus a half first five. Um, again, Tanner, baby, BB. I don't even know how to say that, but yeah, yep. that pitcher, uh, hella mid his first outing. He gave up a few runs, gave up a few gags, uh, was not looking great, but now his strikeouts are up at like six and a half, uh, on the other side of the ball. I think that dude Z Gordo kind of gave a little bit of a rundown for the guardians. Uh, so I won't give too much, but one little nugget that I really liked is the guardians against Pablo Lopez are literally the best team against his strikeouts. Like, he, they strike out the least against him yeah. in terms of all the teams that he's faced is what I mean. Yeah. Um, so I absolutely like that. Uh, also on FanDuel, there's like a winning margin thing. So you could take like guardians first five, like to win by one or two and it's plus like 400. I'm going to be on that. But for the leaderboard, give me the plus a half. Uh, absolutely like this. I think they roll and I'm trying to get the three. Now let's get it. Okay. W packs picks just might be dialed. Let's go, dude. We're trying, bro. Have a good one. Hey, you too. We'll be seeing. We'll be seeing. W sell job. Great sell job. All right. We got goats to, to talk to. We got Prendy, Brian C, French Fry, Josh Mitty, fucking a Hans in Q. He's here for three minutes. So let's go to him. Uh, what's up? It was never Mitch Garver yesterday. I literally, it, it's just a genius strategy for me here. Uh, using the last bit of the NBA regular season to have my worst MLB stretch. Can't hit a bet on the diamond. Um, so for that reason, I'm going to uh, give you an MLB bet today. Uh, Pablo Lopez under six strikeouts on price picks. It is my favorite square on price picks by far, especially because of the push potential, even though we probably don't need it. Uh, Cleveland, they've been a contact heavy team ever since last year. They started off the season again, being a contact heavy team. Uh, and the main nugget here is a strategy that's worked for me ever since Christian Vasquez went to the twins when he's catching for the twins, fade the opposed, fade their starting pitcher in some way. I'm going to strikeouts, Brad, because of Cleveland's contact numbers. So Pablo Lopez under six strikeouts. Okay. W sell job for Mahan per use. Uh, Pablo under K's. Let's go, brother. Yes, sir. Hopefully you took that demon, baby. <laughs> Fuck you. I actually almost did, bro. He's rough. Be seeing. Be seeing. Uh, chat. Oh, Lindor. Oh, no. Sorry. I totally just fake banged you guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Nimmo stole second. Uh, bottom of the ninth, one two count to Lindor. Let's go to some goats that are incubating a queue. Prendy, Brian C, French Fry, Freem the Dream, Josh Mitty. What's up, Prendy? What's up? How are we doing? 
Good. How are you? I'm doing all right. Um, so I'm back and forth on where I, whether I want to go to the ballpark or if I want to go in the hardwood, and I think I'm going to stick to the hardwood today. Um, I got a lot to say about this play, so I'll just keep it brief. Um, I like Luka Doncic over nine and a half rebounds. He's going up against his team that traded him for Trey Young. Um, they're on a back-to-back today, and, and Mavericks are on one day of rest. Um, he's hit this in 13 of his last 16 games. He's hit in seven straight against East teams. He's hit in nine of his last 11 after one day of rest. Um, there's a, It's a pretty high total over there. I expect a lot of possessions. And um, something that's really interesting is the Hawks, over their last 10 games, they're putting up the fourth most three-point attempts and the sixth most field goal attempts. What's going to help us is over the last 10 games on the road, the Hawks are allowing the third most rebounds to guards. Um Doncic is averaging the second most rebound chances on the team behind Gafford, but Gafford's not converting these rebounds whatsoever. Uh, I just like the spot for Luca tonight to just dominate. And, um, you know, I think this is a triple double spot for him, but I like his rebounds the most here. So, okay. That's what I'm with. Luca rebounds as Lindor fleeces the New York Mets with, with a fucking strikeout. Uh, love it. Luca, potential trip dub tonight. He's going to need 10 boards to do it. Let's go. Yes, sir. We'll be seeing. All right. W Prendies. Um, we'll be seized, bro. Getting some major Martians. Let me fix this shit. Tens, tens, Ws. Are we good? Uh, all right. Brian C. and Freem the Dream and Josh Mitty. What's up, Brian C.? Hey, Trent. How you doing? Good, bro. How are you? Good, man. Belly over five. Love it, Ooh. man. Over for and with nine runs, love it, dude. But uh, <laughs> that was a bad play. But I mean, hit one to the warning track, but whatever. But I'm gonna, I can't figure out the hitter, so I'm uh, I actually found a good pitching square that I like today, uh, sort of against your uh, over. But I got uh, Seth Lugo over 30.5 fantasy score for the Royals. Uh, he's facing the White Sox, which we know have been sh- just not hitting. Uh, they're coming off one run against the Braves fourth and fifth starters in the rotation. Um, it's also a home game, which is where um, Lugo looked great. No run, six innings, first game against the Twins. Uh, picking fantasy score because I think – sorry, someone pitched it earlier. I think uh, Soroka may get crushed, and I think your little Bobby Witt hits play may be going up as well. Uh, yeah, need it. I like that. Uh, and then last thing, I saw uh, Lugo is minus 160 on the green book for over 4.5 K. So that'll do nothing but help out that fantasy score for us. And, uh, yeah, that's the play for today. So we're going to mix up. it up, try, try a pitcher today. So Okay. W. Brian C., great sell job. <clears throat> Let's go, bro. All right, Appreciate we'll it. Let's turn it around. We'll be seized, brother. Peace. <laughs> Lindor, you are a Savannah banana. <laughs> Uh, all right, Freem the Dream, Josh Mitty, Big Play Bobber, and French Fry we got in queue. What's up, Freem the Dream? What up, Trent? Uh, first time on, so I'm pretty stoked. Oh, but um, I got a Pittsburgh Penguins money line today on the road against the Caps. Um, dude, Pucks have just been going in the net for them. They beat, yeah. the, they beat the Devils 6-3. They beat the Rangers 5-2. Um, one stat I like about the game uh, – they're first in the league face-off win percentage in the offensive zone, and the Caps are almost dead last in defensive zone uh, face-off wins. So if the Penguins get the puck in their end, I think they're going to win face-offs, and I think the pucks are going to keep flying in. The pucks are indeed flying in Pittsburgh. Just Pens riding and- the hot hand. You just got to ride the hot hand. You have to, bro. You have to. Uh, all right, frame the dream with the Pens. W, first-timer. Let's fucking go, brother. Thank you, dog. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. We'll be seized. Be seeing. Good luck. We love that. We love W new faces. I didn't even make it a mandatory requirement today, and we still got one. Um, Josh Mitty, big play bobber. What's up, Joshua Mitty? Yo, how you doing? Good. Good to see you, man. Uh, I'm going with the uh, Knicks minus three and a half tonight versus the Kings. Uh, Knicks are off for three three straight losses to Spurs, Heat, and uh, who else? They, I forget who else they lost to. But uh, all were hard, hard fall games that they lost uh, just in the fourth quarter. Um, I think this is a perfect get right spot for them coming back home. Uh, they just heard about the Julius Randle news. Uh, this team's slipping, slipping slowly down the Eastern Conference standings. They really need this one. I think they're going to uh, pull it out tonight. Okay. All right. Let's fucking go, Josh Mitty. Nick's in so, the garden. 
Nick's in the garden. Let's get it. Let's go, brother. Appreciate you. All right. I'll catch you. Be seeing. Be seeing. Will Alvarez save the day for the New York Mets? No, he will not. Grounds into a double fucking play to end the inning. Wow. that It just doesn't get more moose shit than the New York Mets. Big play, Bobber. It's never easy being a Met fan, man. <laughs> Watching it right now. Dude, that's brutal. Anyway, uh, I joined a little late. Surely someone had to pitch James Harden, right? No way you're on James Harden today. I mean, just thinking about it, last day of March, I need a D-book for 25. He gets 50 the next day. Yeah. Day one of April, I need 24 PA out of James Harden. He looks like that guy that Mikey Overs tweeted. Yeah. That little, that little <laughs> midget running around in that video. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I think I'm going to go back to it. Uh, James Harden, PA, hold the R. Hold the R. You're going four and a half on PP. Um, so yeah, that's that's what we're going with. Okay. I have a demon here. If you want it, I think I, it could be the worst wager of all time. I just Let's thought it. it caught my eye. Uh, the guy in the Rockets, Amon Amon Thompson. Yeah, he's up for a three. He wow. hasn't hit a three since February 22nd. What the fuck? Uh, he barely takes one a game. I don't know why it's there. Um, but just going off of, like statistics, the Warriors are the second. They allow the second most threes to the power forward position. Um, not saying that means shit, but I just thought it caught my eye. Thought yeah. I just shouted out to the people. I'm always looking for. Uh, I'm always looking for Demon Johnsons like that. So let's go, bro. It's fucking weird. All right, I know. You play Bobber. Yep, he's out. Let's get it, bro. We'll be seeing. Uh, all right, a couple more guys. We still got some time if you want to come sell a pod. I can't, or I'm so excited about my fucking Riley Green rookie Ruby Red Prism Johnson that just skyrocketed in value after that fucking piss nip. Uh, French Fry, what's up, dude? What's up, man? I haven't seen you since the Titanic thing. <laughs> good to see you, man. It's good to see you. How you been? Good, bro. Good. All right. So today, uh, what's what do we got here? I'm going to go with Andres Jimenez. It's 1.5 bases. It's the Demon Square on Price Picks. But he's averaging 0.243 uh, at you know against right-hand pitchers since 2018. He's had 11 bats against Pablo Lopez, and he's averaging a 0.455. So I mean that that sounds really good to me. And he's hit it 1.5 four out of seven. So okay, that's what we're going with today. All right, let's go French fry W play. Let's fucking go, dude. Yep, be seeing. Be seeing. Jimenez total basis for French fry. Jimenez. All right. We got Oxymoron. We got Justin Hokey Green Goby, which I really need to be dialed in today. I need Justin Hockey to be dialed. Oxy, what up, brother? Not much. How are you, buddy? Good. Good to me, see you. Me, you too. Neither one of my teams wanted to win last night. 80 to 80, whatever. Wow. Uh, I was brutal. Um, <laughs> Today, I'm going to throw a bozo pack at you. Philly in the NBA yeah. and Dallas under in the NBA. Philly money line in the under in the Dallas game. Yep. Okay. Oxymoron with a little bozo pack. Uh, it takes a bozo to make a bozo. <laughs> <laughs> it sure does. That's, that's those are the wise words of Oxymoron. You can you can use that anytime you want, <laughs> especially on Ron Mux. Ron Mux bozos. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, bro. All right, good luck. All right, be seeing, dude. It takes a bozo to make a bozo. <laughs> Kels, I'm sorry for missing sub whales. Shout out to the sub whalers. Uh, we got K Prentice says needs the Mets badly. Fuck, dude. Well, you just got the two quickest outs I've ever seen. So hopefully you can get out of this inning. Uh, W's T Crizzy Betts with a gift or with a resub and Barrett with a resub. Supreme Fatty appreciate the 22 month resubber. Uh, NC Hammer W resub Manny Bands with another resub. You're goaded, bro. Appreciate the love, fellas. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, let's go to Justin Hulky, Green Golby. What's up, bro? What's up, Trent? How we doing? Doing good. 
Uh, just want to tell uh, Jeremy Lozon is like minus 400 to get more hits than Samuel Blé, which collects five usually. And I know Chelly's on it, so that's it. And uh, also, I think that's just a feeling, but I think Barkov is a price pick employee tonight. Like that time on ice just doesn't make sense. Like he's a green gob. His line is usually at 20 and a half. And they bump him down almost a minute and to make him green like that doesn't make sense because he's been hitting okay well shit, dude what am i taking the hits prop or the under time on ice uh, i'm not that that sure on the time on ice but just the thing i wanted to do okay but lay zone hits today mega max worthy yeah probably oh my dude that might be the second but put him in the lay put him in the lay hockey yeah. Okay. You think it will be? Get, you think it will get bumped to five? Yeah, probably soon. Fuck. I already know it's about to get bumped. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's go, Justin Hulky. Let's have a day. Appreciate you, homie. We'll be seeing. Yeah, we'll be. Peace. All right. Well, let's try and craft up and get a couple more sell jobs before this shit gets bumped. We got Sir Money. Sir Money, what up, dude? Hey, I got uh, James Harden, Demon Square for the 2.53s. Both games he played against Denver, he hit three threes. He, last game, he had 11 points. And in the first game they played of the season, he had 20 points. So I got the uh, Demon Square for the three threes. I love it. I love it. The Demon. That might have to make our Demon slip today. Let's go. Yep. Appreciate you, sir, money. Be seeing. All right, we got two more geysermans here. Coop Eagle and Banker Better. Coop Eagle, Dennis Schroeder, a million assists last night. Career high. Career yeah, high. I got, <laughs> uh, I got another under for you tonight. Uh, yeah. Joel, Joel Embiid under nine and a half rebounds. Oh, okay. He returned last game and he only had six rebounds on 11 chances. I don't know if you watched the game, but he, he looked exhausted out there. He wasn't really crashing the boards at all. He was playing passive and just kind of worrying about scoring, which I think will do the same tonight against Miami. Uh, Miami's top 10 def defense first rebounding centers. And, yeah. Okay. W Coop Eagle. Let's bounce back, bro. Yeah. Let's bounce back. All right. GG's, homie. Be seeing. Be seeing. W Coop Eagle. Oh. Coop Eagle with the big bet Ben sell job on Schroeder unders. <laughs> Banker better. I need you dialed, brother. What's going on, Trent? Yo. Porzingis was free yesterday. Free. One of the freest squares. Shout out to Uncle Vito with uh, Clint. Uh, rebounds. I'm up so many units. I paired my Porzingis and Clint, and I'm up, up units. So shout wow. out to Uncle Vito. Uncle Vito is the man. Today, I've got uh, Joker rebounds and assists. I've heard a lot of people on his triple-double, so if you like that number, um, just go with his rebound as an assist. I think it was at 21 and a half, 22, something like that. Um, but, yeah, that's what I'm riding today. I've seen his rebounds were on the popular tab. Scared me a little bit. I did take it this morning at 12 and a half. Seen it was already bumped to 13, so that's good. Um, but I've done a little bit more diving into the, to the matchups, and I like his triple-double. So I'm just going to go as rebounds and assists as well. Wow. I asked you to fucking dial in and you give me my death beam square. Yo, Kichare. All right. Be seeing you, Trent. Thanks. Let's go. Banker, you're him. Let's have a day. Be seeing. Fuck, man. How do I not put Jokic in the, in the entry again? Uh, Mets, are up, Mets are up to bat right now. Beatty at plate. Let's go to my guy, Costco guy. What's up, dude? What's up, Trent? What's up, man? Me and my, me and my boy, you know what I'm saying? What up? Uh, so, Tyler Anderson, you know, he's winning Cy Young, but the Angels don't play today, so I got a different play. <laughs> uh, we got the under in the Nationals-Pirates game. Oh. Josiah Gray, he might win the NL Cy Young. Josiah Gray. Yeah. Shout out to for the Nationals, you know, it's a shit program, but it's all right. It is a shit program. It is. That's all. that's all I got right there. All right, let's go, dude. Let me know if you see Big Justice running around. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm on the lookout today. <laughs> All right, bro. Appreciate right, you. Yeah. Holy shnikes.
Gee whiz. Uh, all right. We got my guys, Jim and Spencer J to talk us in. What's up, Spence? What's up, man? How you doing? Good. How are you? Doing all right. I've been on a day or two, but to come on here, I'm going to do Sabonis, triple double tonight. Sabonis, trip dubs. Yep. They're, they're playing in New York, but yeah, in the garden. They're going to win out right tonight. I know that for sure, but um, Sabonis can get triple double with it as well. Okay. All right. Let's go, brother. Let's do it. Appreciate you. We'll be seeing. Peace. Look at Benny Bats, dude. Benny Bats, where the fuck are we tuning in from? <laughs> no, come back. There he is. <laughs> no. That was a vibe. And in play outs for Marte. Dude, this team is dog shit. Dog shit. Oh, he's at Target Field. Wow. Oh, he's on Shelly's Nerfy. Um. All right, you got McNeil. McNeil's gonna have to bring the coins home for you Mets betters right now. Uh, chat. How do I not, Kels? You got no play for me. You got no demon for me today. Got a lot of good games. There she is. Oh, we got a long came Holly spawning in. Wow, Holly, I need you dialed. What's good, Holly? Hey. So. <laughs> I just noticed, I think you guys are already on this, so you've probably heard this today. Um, Harden points. <laughs> oh, my God, Holly, no way. I know. I'm like, I could pivot to something else, but I already had all my notes written down. <laughs> no, don't pivot. Stick with it. It's totally good. <laughs> yeah, no, it, his last five looked terrible, but when you look at the Clippers versus the Nuggets, he, he does well. So... I, I think it might still be a sweat, but I think he hits his points. We're nuking it, Holly. You know, <laughs> it's going to be a sweat, but we're going to be in this together, and it's going to turn green for us all. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Me too. Uh, let's go, Holly. Thank you for rolling through. It's great to see you. Yeah, you too. All right. We'll be seeing. Yeah. Peace. Holly is just like the biggest W ever. Uh, Benny Betts, let's try it again, brother. You're muted, by the way, if you can hear me. You're muted. <laughs> Chalk it. <laughs> I don't think he knows that the mute, whatever. All right. This is exactly how I wanted to end the stream. Oh, my guys have been free coin. Let's go. He's red hot. Chernak was literally the greenest of gobs it gets. He was. He was. We're on a roll here. Let's keep it going. Sorry my, you, boys, sorry, my boys couldn't show up for yeah, you. Yeah, dude. Before you give me your play, what the fuck was that bagel I watched? I know. Those posts, man. As soon as we hit those posts, oh I, knew, I knew it was over. It was just yeah. like, we just did the same thing against St. Louis, like four posts. And it's just like, fuck, we can't buy one right now. But No, I know. D Big Dave. Is, dude, we saw two posts that looked like they were literally in the fucking goal. And Dave was like, yeah, this shit ain't going over. Yeah, yeah. He knew <laughs> it. You know, it's chalked right there. Yeah. All right, we're going to go to an important game tonight, Pittsburgh-Washington. It's going to be a physical game, you know, long-term rivalry between Crosby, Ovechkin, these two teams, playoff matchups, et cetera. Yeah. We have Tom Wilson coming off a six-game suspension tonight, and Wilson at home loves to hit. Loves to hit. Tom Wilson over three hits. Meet on tape. Oh, my God. Oh, Let's go four straight. As a former hockey player, when you've been sitting watching some games, you're just you're just amped up to get on the ice. Yeah, especially when it's a you know it's a big game. I mean, Washington can essentially bury the Penguins here, so it's it's huge. And I, I think love it. Wilson's bringing his A game. I'm sold. Thoughts on Lazone before you go? Yeah, I liked Lazone until I saw Chelly was on him, but. I mean, <laughs> I'm sorry, Shelly. I love you. You know I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, the guy literally can't catch a break. And I really hope – I really – I I honestly, I love Shelly's entry tonight more than probably any in the last three weeks. So Wow. He's right. It's going to be a physical game. It's, an, it's another important game for both sides. And, and yeah. Well, wait, yeah. Okay. Just, I hope he doesn't get bumped to five. I'll just leave him at four and a half. Yeah, please. Dude. I'll be so mad. But, yeah. I like Leo, Leo's on. Yeah. All right, let's go. Jets, Jets money line tonight. Book it. 
Yes, that's in the Fugues. Let's fucking go. Cheers. Okay, sweet. Cheers. Stay good. It will be seen. We'll be seen. Love it. Love it. All right. Uh, I'm going to Jen. Benny Betts, one more time. Third time's a charm. I can't hear you, but twins. Minus one and a half. Pablo, Demon Square, six and a half Ks. We're, it's electric here. Look at this. It's packed. Twins opening day. We'll be seeing, Trent. We'll be Let's fucking go. seeing, bro. Yes, sir. How's it? Peace, bro. Oh, dude. Electric. Let's go. The vibes, the vibes are high over there. Fuck yeah, bro. We'll be seeing. We'll be seeing. W's. Uh, all right. We got three more guys, and we're wrapping this up. I'm going to go to Dog Ass V. What up, Dog Ass V? Thanks for coming back on. Uh, what up, man? How we doing? Uh, good. I'm good. Hey, yesterday I gave you LeBron. Missed he by the nine, one. but he didn't yeah. hit the 10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, we tailed yeah. you, though. We tailed you with the regular line. Shit was free, so thank you. Yeah, yeah. Today I got uh, Sidney Crosby to score a goal. Sydney and I like, uh, yeah, I like the game to go over too. Capitals and the Penguins. Let's fucking go, dog ass B. That could be sharp. He's he's banging one home. Yeah, yeah. But I might have to post out. I got something to do real quick. That's all I wanted to give you real quick. I gotta go real quick. All right. Appreciate you. We'll be seeing. Let's go, dog ass B. Dog ass V's dialed. All right. Uh the Jen and intern. I've never lost a bet, Rav. What's up? What's up? Um, has anybody talked about the Panthers today, the Florida Panthers? No, the brotherly Super Bowl, bro. What's that? Oh, Chuck versus Kachuk. Yes. Yeah, that should be fun. Um, I uh, All right, so we hit the plus money play last time with Isak Paredes. That was, dude. Surgical, right? Dude. Yeah, I've been a ratchet gambler for two months, but honestly, what have you done for me lately? That's what I did for you lately. All right, yeah. so fuck off the chirpers. But I got, I think this can offset because I'm going to go minus 155 with the Florida Panthers here. But hold on, hear me out for a second. This is what I think. If anybody's betting this game or or betting hockey in general, shit gets weird right now because teams are kind of locked in. Some teams are locked into their playoff spots. Or I think teams might be intentionally losing to try to dodge others. Anyways, I'm not going to get into that, but the Florida Panthers have been really bad the last 10 games. They're two, seven, and one, but they've 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 locked their playoff spot. And pretty much regardless of what happens, I think they're gonna play the Leafs. Chelly or somebody else can correct me if I'm wrong. I think they know who they're gonna play. So they haven't really given a fuck. I think they're trying to stay healthy. And you can tell uh from the little that I have watched or followed that they're not really in it. But here's what I think: you want to play your best hockey or good hockey going into the playoffs. I do think that's important while trying to mitigate injuries, right? Last game of the road trip. They're in Ottawa, okay? The Ottawa Senators are a team that people were really high on coming into the season. I sniffed that shit out early and faded them to miss the playoffs back in fucking October at minus 170. So I am looking to just get a few more units fading these fuckers, and I think I'm going to do it tonight with the Florida Panthers. I think the Florida Pan the, the Senators, by the way, had won like five or six straight, and then they just lost in overtime to the Wild. But they still, I don't know if you guys, I think Jovan or maybe BTL had the Senators in that game. The uh, Senators okay. actually outplayed the Wild. Corpusalo, their goalie, allowed three goals and 19 shots. But they outshot him and whatnot. I think this is a fade spot for the Senators tonight. I think the, the Panthers are going to try to play some good hockey. So I'm going to take them on the money line. And I will tell you this. Last thing. I know I'm yapping. I'm sorry. No, you're good. If it doesn't come through, do you know what the Martingale is? Yeah. Okay. Then the Panthers go home and they play the Bruins and then they play the Senators again. Let me tell you right now. The Senators are not going to Fort Lauderdale with five games left in regular season to play competitive hockey. They are going to Fort Lauderdale to go to the top floor of Tussies and get their shoulders rubbed, okay? <laughs> so I will be martingaling the fuck out of the Florida Panthers in two games if this doesn't come through. But the Panthers today is my favorite play. I love it. Panthers money line, potential Fugues piece. Let's clap go. it up. Bill. Let's clap it up before it loses. Let's clap <laughs> it up before it loses. All right, Trent, good luck. Thanks again for the raid the other day. I appreciate it. Of course, brother. Stay go to the gen. All right, good luck, man. Be seeing, be seeing. So much just happened. We got a five U sub whaler from Putts. We got a single from Riley Green. And and Matt Vierling re reaches on a fielder's choice, but third baseman Matt Brett Beatty to catcher uh Omar Navarez, Andy Abanez out at home. GG's.
uh, to Tigers betters. Gets fucking yoinked at home. Intern Rav. What's up, bro? I forget. Did you have the Suns over yesterday? Yeah, I did. You start trolling me about winning bets, and I fucking lose a bet. So thanks. Why, why didn't you just go with your wagon Suns? I know. You were on them, too. You have oh, four. Give me coin. Um, by the way, before I give a play, uh, three coins – uh tom wilson bet is a like that's a boom that's just a boom. Try, yeah no that's a that's a boom big justice they hate he hates the penguins the penguins hate him it's his first game back for a playoff game like that shit's hitting big justice um, okay so i'm just gonna go heat ml real quick um i how did i know i literally knew when i was looking at the slate that that would be your play <laughs> i'm going back that's the last team that won me won me coin i'm going again yeah um basically huge game for playoffs i like riding like playoff vacations they need they're both vying for the 60 which is huge um they have jimmy butler terry rozier has been going off and b's gonna be still a little bit on a minutes restriction he had 29 minutes last game out of out of 48 obviously um the miami's more comfortable at home they've been playing a lot of home games recently so i trust them and it really is telling that vegas is making them the favorites so i'm gonna go heat money on Heat ML for intern yeah. Rav. Looking yeah, I'm going to pair Tom Wilson square with something because that shit is it's, it's it's, Yeah, well, I'm going to make a fucking donkey four man that we're going to cash today. Bet. And I need the fucking Tigers. He looked he look safe at home, but I guess not. Yeah, that shit might be cookie. It's cookie. All right. All right. We'll be seeing. Be seeing. Let's go. In play runs for the Tiger rumors. In play runs. I'm seeing. How many of them is the question? I think one. I think just one. <laughs> As I say, shit's cookie. Colt Keith. Wow, dude. Javon told me to draft him, and I fucking didn't. Doubles on a fly ball. Matt Verling at third. Ruby Red, Riley Green scores. Let's go. Skyrocketing value. Lucas Johnson in Q for the last sell job of the day. Yes, sir. Trent, what's up, man? Can you hear me? Yes, sir. How's it going? Cool. Uh, it's good. I'm good. How are you? Great. Great. Dope. Uh, it's been a super long time since I've been on here, but I uh, actually have a nerfy for today. Oh, what do you um, got? Yeah, so I see. I saw a lot of people on the Guardians, but I'm over on Washington and Pittsburgh. Um, that one's – I think this is automatic. None of these hitters really have even hit against Josiah Gray or Perez. Like, I look at the lineup, and it's – uh Reynolds here he bats 500 against um he bats 500 against Josiah Gray that's the only the only hitter that really scares me that second yeah um it looks good it looks good Josiah Gray allowed like six or seven runs in his first outing and none of them came in the first inning I'm really not scared of uh anything in the first inning here I have it with the Guardians too okay. um in the two-man but that's my play for today one unit all right let's go Lucas little yes, sir thank you Trent of course, bro. Have a great day. Have a good one. You too. Good luck. Six quick ones for the kid. Javon, what was Ruby Rose's entry? I need to know. Or are you just fucking with me? Are you fucking with me? Can we craft? Can we craft some whales, please, before our shit gets chalked? Can we please craft? What's Ruby Rose's entry? It's not on her Twitter. I'm looking at it. I'm look. It's on promo tab. PJ Wash. Oh my God, she might have been fucking dialed, bro. Dude, she was. She might have been dialed. Free coin says put fifty bucks on the entry that's in your DMs. Oh, I'm tailing that. That's a demon slip. If I've ever seen one. If you guys want to tail free coin with his ner uh with his demons, Colt Keith scores six three tigers. Six three tigers. The Mets are moo shit. Uh this looks like a really good slip, if I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm uh I'm gonna sprinkle on that. I might pick my four favorite. Um, chat, I've got three legs. We need one more. We need one more leg. Oh, I got Martians. 
Let me fix this. Check, check. We've got three legs. I need one more. And I'm I might this might be my sack up in new country. This might be the sack up in new country, boys. We need one more leg. This is three for three. We need one more leg. What's it going to be? You wish you could pitch? I don't know why you said you can't pitch. Paul Goldschmidt? I would, but I don't want any early cake, bro. Can't stand it. Can't stand it. What's the fucking play? Let me go look at our meat sheet board. Food poisoning? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know that. I can't put Jokic in here because he's already in the other one. But I wouldn't. I could be convinced. I don't know, dude. Baseball might be out of a of the question for this entry. No Bobby? No Bobby, dude. I already have a fucking Mega Max on the five man. No McKinnon, no Bobby Witt, no Jokic. Oh my God, is it Bogdanovich? Is it Bogdanovich PRA? The coaching narrative with Bogdanovich. It's Gafford. What was Nug's POD? Fuck, dude. Is it Jokic? I'm just thinking about the fact Banker Better came on and gave me my death beam. I think it's Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich is an option. I'm going to put Jokic RA as a potential option. Only one exception for Jokic. Bases are yoinked in Detroit right now or in New York. Um, we are fading. Oh, yeah, you're fading Luca. I, I I can't fade Luca, dude. Not for a rack of Rooney. Bogdan gonna popular tab gonna have ten. Bogdan popular tab. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Is he? No, he's not. Bogdanovich is not on popular tab. Bogdanovich is a coin sealer. Gafford Fantasy is a donk since he sold last one. No, you're not wrong. Someone pitched Gafford, right? This is where I fumble. No one pitched Gafford. We are a bit scared of a blah. There's only it did it might but if we go Jokic, we're banking on two plays in the same game going our way. Boston was supposed to blow them out too. It didn't happen. The spread's creeping down a bit. Yeah, I just like I hate first half plays, dude. I, I'm not the biggest first half guy. Um why not MLB? Because it's Bobby Witt or nothing in the late games. I need something I could sweat out on night sweats. It's 404 ATL day. What does that mean? What does that mean?
I mean, dude. You don't think you don't think Luca is the move tonight? It's 404 area code and it's April 4th. Gafford, I thought someone pitched Gafford today. Am I tripping? Dude, I don't want you guys to steer me in a direction that's going to come back to fuck me over, bro. Go with Gafford. This is like, this is exactly how yesterday went. This is exactly how yesterday went. Why don't I bet on UFC? Because whatever I bet on loses. My gut says Bogdanovich, bro. Let me go look at some props.wales. Let me book check it and props.wale it. Player combos. Bogdanovich, 124 and a half. Or minus one twenty five. Uh, oh no. Um, and then yeah, choose to the over on the books. Choose to over on books. Love that. Let's go props out whale. Let me see what that chart looks like on props out whale. I just love the Bogdanovich play as soon as I heard it. But like a thousand dollars on Bogdanovich would be crazy, bro. Dallas. Dude, I think it's this, bro. Yeah, it is going to help, bro. I just like visually seeing it. I like visually. Is it two green gobs? I don't. I really don't think that that's going to be an issue with how green it is, bro. Especially after a moose shit game. A moose shit game. And get. Yeah, bro. Dude. This is the play. This is the fucking play. And I feel so much better. I didn't feel shoved. I didn't feel steered in a different direction. These are meat on tape plays. I'm doing it. And I'm putting a fucking rack on it. Jalen Johnson news really matters with Bogdan. What's the news? If he's going to play or not? I'm locking this in before Lazone gets fucking bumped. If this doesn't hit, it's completely on me. Completely on me. This is a, a, yeah, a real rack, Chote. I, I earned this rack last night at the Stars game, and I'm throwing it on this four, man. And if it hits, I'm cashing out $10,000, and I'm fucking going on a vacation. Bogdan's kind of yapped in on the road. Now you got me back at prompts. Not piss. He is kind of yapped in on the road. What about his points?
Elliot Ligma. Tarasenko SOGs? Nah. That's for our demon entry. Fuck. Fuck. Um, um, now I, I, I lost it. We were right there. We were right fucking there. I, I was I was this close. I was this close to just fucking locking it. No, but I can't go back. It's fucking Bogdanovich, dude. It's Bogdanovich. I'll never forgive myself if I change it up. The only thing that's... The only doubt I have... Sorry, it's when Kel, it's when I keep moving and I go away like this, and then it focuses on the mic. I got to come back. <sighs> Do you think it was a good step off? I just don't know why we're hating on Bogdanovich, especially after him fucking yanking on his coach's, choking his coach's chicken, dude. Kels, I'm going to need you to quit bitching about the setup. I'm going to need you to quit bitching about setup. Bogdono. All right, fuck it, man. I need a breather. I'm hearing Bogdono. I'm hearing so much fucking bullshit. I was this close, Yeti. I was this close to just shutting, blocking the noise and, and locking it. I fucking lost it. This is exactly, exactly how we fumble every fucking time. I already know, like, whatever the fuck goes in here is cooked. Let me just, you're going to just hear silence for like a minute, okay? Because I need to think.
Yeah, we're too we're too far balls deep into it, man. We're two balls deep into it, bro. And the biggest of this game. It's good. Wins the game. That's the buzzer. Biggest the Super Bowl, but the difference is it's just two guys playing shit that they did in the studio. Biggest of the city versus that of me, and they be terrible, just like a two-year-old. I love a dinner with some fine women when they start debating about who to go. And I'm like, go oh, ahead, yeah. say it then. I feel good about it, dude. I feel good. I feel great about the fact that I didn't let anybody talk me off my original uh, foundation. My original foundation. That's exactly what I wanted. And it will make me feel so much better knowing that I didn't let you fumble it. I fumbled. Yesterday, we fumbled. We fumbled collectively together. Today, it's on me. And this is a fucking donk of a cinch entry, dude. Donk of cinch. No, I, I even saw... When I saw that Bogdanovich shit, I said... I want to be on him whenever he plays next. Totally forgot about it. I was reminded of it today, and I'm in love with the play. I'm in love with the play. Um, so I feel really good about it. Whatever happens, happens. Uh, if I cash this, I will literally be so fucking bricked. Uh, and I'm going on a yacht. If this hits, I'm yachting. If not, uh, I'm going into I'm going into hiding. Thanks, Rito. Let's make let's finalize a quick demon entry. Oh, if this hits 24 hour entry, I'll do it with crabs. There you go. If this entry hits, I will join Krabs' 24 hour stream and I will run it with him. I will do it with him. The whole stream, if it hits. If it hits, that I swear to God, I'll do it. No fucking lemonade stand. No 100, uh, 100, 100 Hawaiian roll bullshits. This is the entry. This is the entry. Lazone hits. He's the Acuna of hockey. Let me send the link. He's the Acuna of hockey. Tom Wilson hits after a six-game suspension is going to come out buzzing. James Harden points on a bounce back after being absolutely moose shit the past couple of games. He's scoring 17 plus. And Bogdanovich PRA in Dallas. Fuck, dude. I might have to go with this game tonight. Uh, no, I'm not going. But Bogdanovich, after yapping his coach's ear off, screaming at him in his face for pulling him early uh, and having a shit last game. I think he had 16 points or 16 PRA. Yeah, he's going to be he's gonna be, be getting a lot of minutes tonight, and he's going to splooge over this PRA, bro. I love it. I love it. I'm in fucking love with this entry, man. If you are riding with me, best of luck. It's only appropriate you're on before all games of slip start. What? Everything has a reason. Every square has a story, bro. That's that's what we that's what we preach here. Link for the entry is right here. And Quick Fugazi 5 to tap the kids in. Skywalker, do you know my straight bets or you want me to say them out loud? I'll say them out loud. Straight bets. Uh, Warriors minus four and a half. Clippers plus four and a half. Wow, Jokic rebounds just went to minus 166. <laughs> Love that for my entry. Love that. 
Um, sorry. My card. Oh, he's got the whole card ready to go. Let's go. All right. Fugazi Fiber. Starts with the Winnipeg Jets. Let's go with the Royals, too. And Kyrie's up to minus 130. Yeah, that means anything, right? Let's go with the Royals to beat the White Sox. Let's go with the Winnipeg Jets and the Avalanche. Then we go to the NBA. I want to take Warriors money line. Do we tail intern Rav, who's never lost a wager until last night? Or no. We don't do that. Why don't we take a CBB play? What's the line in this game tonight? I don't know why it's not showing on here. Is it Seton Hall or Indiana State? Is it the Sycamores? I think it's the Sycamores, dude. Or is it Seton Hall? Is it too late for you to come chug a grape ape on the stream? Absolutely not, bro. Buzz on Seton Hall. Okay. Maybe we stay away from that shit. You're all over lingering saves. Uh, I feel like we need another NBA, Johnson. Intern Rab's heat. What's the backstory for the Warriors? It's my, one of my I'm very I'm confident in them covering tonight, so hopefully they can fucking win. Dude, I don't know what to do, chat. I need one more leg. Hold on, hold on, it's coming to me. It's coming to me. I say we take intern Rav's shit wager. No, nah, it's a shit wager. It's a shit wager. Why not just go Mavs ML plus 500? Kind of soft. Kind of soft. I don't know, dude. Everything looks like cat shit. What if we went with season or er, Seton Hall? Everything looks like cat shit. Could just take the shot or the Kings and call it. Seton Hall would be a crazy little lay piece. Yeah, it took the fucking over in the other's game. Uh, what's the money line for Seton Hall? 
plus 135. So if I did plus 130, oh, that's too much. That's too much. I don't need plus 1200, bro. I'm just trying to make coin today, man. These four are winning. I'm not trying to get cute with Seton Hall. I'll make a straight bet out of that because I'm down to ride. Uh, but I think we go with, with let's give intern Rav intern Rav a shot, dude. I'm not taking the Nuggets. I'm giving intern Rav, who's never lost a wager, a shot. <sighs> we got two NBAs, uh, two NHLs, and an MLB guys here. Should go well. Let's give Rav a chance. Plus nine hundred and fifty. Send that to fucking Daniel for his Mega Max. Uh, Rav, actually, if nah, I'll send it to Daniel, bro, fuck that. Yeah, dude. This internship could be cookie if the Heat sell. If the Heat are the only leg to lose this, internship done. Uh, yeah, Rav, I'll send you the, the link to the PP slip. All right, chat. We've got a Fugazi five. We've got the morning yap prize picks entry. We've got a community four man. Um, we've got my straight bets and we've got a Fugazi five. Let's fucking go. <laughs> W stream. Oh, the demon slip, demon slip, demon slip. One unit on a demon slip. I'm going to have the fucking depot for this one. Uh, Before I go, before I go, we need a quick demon. No demon, John? Yes, demon, John. Demon, John. Uh, All right, it started with Tarasenko and Zaka. <laughs> oh, that doesn't look terrible. Doesn't look bad at all. We we need five though. Absolutely need five. Goose Gossage. No, that's definitely Goose Gossage. Let's pick one more NBA. Any other NBA Demon Johns? Is Crosby Gold Demon? Fifteen and a half rebounds would be would be insane for Jokic. Let's go find some points, dude. Points is a demon. Wait, hold on. What's Crosby? Oh. Oh, let's take this, bro. That's an a 12xer.
27 extra. No, you got to make it a five. You got to make it five legs. Harden and Bobby Witt to steal. That pays. That fucking pays. And that's not asking for a whole lot. I mean, the two half Johns and the ice are definitely a little wishy-washy, but could absolutely happen. Harden can absolutely make two th or three threes. We know Bobby could steal a bag. Uh, Tarasenko, two and a half shots. That's like a normal line, basically. And Zaka to get an assist. I don't know much about that one, but Welta stays hitting them Johnson. So let's go. I'm depoting and placing that five-man Johnson. But here... Is that Mega Max? Here is this Mega Max, and I'm calling it a day. I'm calling it a day. <laughs> Chat, it's been an absolute pleasure. Thank you for hanging out with me on this stream. Let's have a legacy day. Go tune into the morning yap if you haven't watched it yet. Um, I'll spam the link right here if you want to tune into that. Promise you it's worth the watch. Let me copy the link. W streamers, man. Go watch the morning yap right now. Go click that link right now. If you if you love me, click that link. I'm just spamming it a million times. Um, all right, Rizzy Raids. Rizzy Raids. Where am I going? Where am I taking you? Should I send you to sketch? You want sketch? No sketch. Change a life. Someone give me a life changing raid. I don't know how you just, I don't know how you expect me to have life changing raids on deck. Did I see the bottom of the leaderboard? No. 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 Bamuel Chaco, Daros, Rizzy Fear Aiken, who? Br Br Jacob. De All right. Who do you want? Who do you want? Who do you want? Please. Andy Bobandy. That sounds super sus. He's got two two people playing Valorant. No cam. How are you giving me raids with no cam? Can we just try Sketch, bro? I've never raided Sketch, but he's like at the gym. I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, he ain't locked, bro. He's like working out. Yeah, he ain't going to see the raid, bro. Sugar Sean's a homie. You got nothing. I'm going to type in a random ass name. John. What happens if I type in John? Johnny Bravo. Four dude. There's four people watching this shit. Four people. Or Mike. Let's just type in Mike. Mike tricks on it, no cam. Uh, what about Nick? It's 
Dude, why do you stream on Twitch with no camera? Why is that an option for people? This guy, Nick Bully, is playing Fortnite. Let's see. What he, I'm just going to send you to this guy, Nick Bully, bro. He's got four people watching him play Fortnite. GG's. GG's. I don't know who the fuck this guy is. Hopefully, it's a good raid. Maybe. Maybe it makes his day. Maybe it ruins it. I don't know. We'll find out. Be seeing. Oh, shit, I'm seeing this. 